Today we are going to discuss about top 7 best cheap drones available in the market. Through extensive research we have tested dozens of products and bring the top 7 best cheap drones for you. For price of these cheap drones, check the links in description below. For more videos subscribe this channel and press bell icon to support our efforts. Let's get started. Number 7. Gulor CT36 Some people may be fine with paying $20 for a fancy sandwich, but what about a drone? Laying down a Jackson will get you the no-frills Gulor CT36 drone. At just over 3 inches wide, it's tiny but surprisingly tough, with blade protectors around the rotors and a 3-minute flight time from the tiny 190 mAh rechargeable battery. The drone comes with a spare set of rotor blades, two lithium-ion batteries, and a charger, while its diminutive remote is powered by three AAA batteries. The T-36 is a fun drone to fly with a decent amount of speed and maneuverability. It is bare bones though, there's no camera, only a few simple stunts and no GPS. It does include a feature called return to home, but that's just a fancy name for a mode that sets the drone to fly in only one direction and then return when you push the right stick up. Still, it's a fun little drone, and for $20, there won't be too many tears if it gets lost up a tree. Number 6. Snaptain S5C The Snaptain S5C has a neat, angular design complete with rather bright red and green LEDs near the motors. However, the large rotor blades are somewhat noisy in flight. The S5C can be controlled from the included controller, through the Snaptain Era app, or through hand gestures. Select this in the app, then make a two-finger victory sign at the camera, and it can counts down and takes a photo. Hold up an open hand with the fingers extended and it starts recording video. Do that again and it stops recording. It's surprisingly effective. The S5C captures video at 1280 by 720, 720p resolution, but the video is rather grainy and noisy. There is no image stabilization, so every bump and dip of the drone is captured, along with a pronounced rolling shutter effect, where the video looks like wobbly jello. Even though the S5C is light, it gets blown off course easily, it's underpowered, set the drone flying forwards, and it loses altitude because the motors can't run fast enough to keep the altitude up. The S5C comes with two matchbook-sized rechargeable batteries, each of which can power the drone for about 7 to 8 minutes of flight. Plus simple and fun to fly plus gesture control for hands-free photos. Plus comes with two batteries blown around by any tiny breeze. Lackluster photo and video quality. Number 5. Snaptain a 15H. Do you like DJI's drones but can't afford them? Snaptain's a 15H is inspired by the design of the DJI Mavic Mini, right down to the way the arms fold up, but costs a quarter of the price. The A15H is a fun drone to fly and has some neat tricks, like the ability to flip 360 degrees in the air. The controller is powered by three AAA batteries and looks like an Xbox controller that's been attacked by a button bedazzler. There are 16 buttons in addition to the two controls sticks. While the video is captured in 720p resolution, it's grainy and blurry, even in bright light. There is no gimbal stabilization on the camera, so you only get a straight-ahead view that bumps and shakes as the drone maneuvers. It also has a serious case of rolling shutter, where video looks wobbly. The F15H's battery only holds about 800 may have charge, so you only get about 5 minutes of flight time. You do get two batteries, though. Number 4. UDIU 818 AFPV Drone The Force One U 818A is one of the larger of the best cheap drones, but most of this size is due to the built-in rotor blade guards. That's a good thing for novice flyers. The circular blade protectors save the blades from being damaged by sticks, fingers, and more. The lightweight plastic case is flimsy and feels like it would easily break in a moderate speed collision. The camera hangs below the center of the drone and can be angled manually to point from straight ahead to about 30 degrees down. Its camera can record video at a 720 resolution, stored on the micro SD card that fits into the back of the camera body. The accompanying app, available for both iOS, opens a new tab and Android, can control the drone and shows a 480p resolution video preview. View. This can be switched to 720 ped, but that gets a little glitchy when the drone is more than 20 to 25 feet away. The U818 flies well, hovering when you release the control sticks on the small remote, but turning and banking quickly when you maneuver it around. It isn't particularly fast though, you get about 8 to 10 minutes of flight time from its 350 mAh battery and two are
included. This combination of maneuverability, stability, and battery life makes it a great pick for those who are more interested in video than aerobatics. Number 3. Rise Tech Tello Not only is the Rise Tech Tello a fun drone to fly, but it's designed to help kids learn to program by dropping blocks of code, Lego style, into an app using the Scratch programming language. There's a bit of a learning curve though, so children may need some guidance on just how to program the Tello. Designed by DJI, the Tello is a light but solidly built drone with an electronically stabilized camera that can record video at 720 slash 30 eps and take 5 MP photos. Rise advertising the Tello has been able to fly for up to 13 minutes on a charge, but we found its flight time to be about half that. Either way, it's worth investing in a few spare batteries. The Tello also does not come with a physical remote control, so you'll have to use your smartphone, Android, and iOS, unless you want to spend an extra $50 on a controller. The Tello is available in a few different colors. There's even an Iron Man branded model for Marvel Fanatics, plus 720 camera, plus can be programmed, plus well-built, doesn't come with remote. Number 2. Propel Star Wars TIE X1 Advanced The Force is with the Star Wars-themed drone, which initially cost nearly $200, but now can be had for less than $50. The controller that comes with the Propel TIE X1 Advanced not only lets you perform flips and other tricks, but has a number of sound effects and audio clips from the original trilogy. It all comes in an impressive box that plays the Star Wars theme when you open it up. The details on the TIE X1 are pretty good, and it even looks like the ship has seen a bit of wear and tear hair. In flight, it's fast enough to make the Kessel run in less than 12 parsecs. Propel also makes an X-Wing fighter version of this drone, as well as a speeder bike, complete with Stormtrooper. Even better, infrared lights and sensors inside each drone let you battle with other Propel Star Wars drones. When you hit another drone, it will spin in the air. Too bad these drones lack cameras to capture video of your dogfights, but otherwise, they're great fun for Star Wars fans. Number 1. Holy Stone HS-110D The Holy Stone HS-110D makes our list of the best cheap drones because it's one of the few at this price that has a 1080p camera. While not up to the same level as a DJI drone, it does provide better video quality than other drones on this page, making it a good starter for aspiring videographers. Like many of the other cheap drones on this list, flight time is around 8 minutes, which is decent for a drone at this price. We also like that the company includes two batteries, so your downtime isn't too great, and this drone is pretty easy to fly, two plus a larger drone that can fly at decent speeds, plus built-in 1080p camera flimsy construction. Video gets blurry and jittery as the drone maneuvers. Thanks for watching guys, I hope you liked this video. If you have any questions related to the products we listed here, leave a comment down below, and I will get back to you as soon as I can.